Police say the boy brought a kitchen knife onto the school bus. Another student saw this knife and then notified the school bus driver. And now school officials are urging parents to check their children's backpacks before sending them off to school. I'm almost about to pull my kids out. It's not safe. This Norwich mother not wanting to show her face on camera, expressing her concern to Fox 61 after receiving this letter from the superintendent Tuesday morning. It stayed shortly after 8 a.m. A fourth grade boy of John B. Stanton Elementary School was found to have a kitchen knife on the school bus. Norwich police say another student on the bus saw the knife and notified the school bus driver. Right away, several officers and a school official responded. There were three students on the bus at the time, and all of them are safe. I don't even know if it's truly the child's fault. You have to look at the parenting, what's causing the child to even think about doing that. Board of Education Chairman Robert Aldi advising parents to check their children's backpacks now. It's concerning. It's frightening. Police say it is still unclear why the boy had the knife. Why was a student carrying the, uh, the, the knife in the first place? What, what, could, what would trigger him, him or her, to, to use that knife? Under state law, police say anyone under 11 years old cannot be arrested, and the boy's punishment is ultimately up to school officials. This incident, however, reminding Aldi of the teacher who was recently shot in Virginia by her six-year-old student, something they hope to similarly prevent. There's been a serious uptick again in, in school violence. You know, just look what happened uh, not too long ago in, uh, in Virginia. I would think that would have been preventable if somebody yeah, had talked to that child. The superintendent's office did not tell us how this child will be disciplined, but we do know that the child is not allowed back into this school. In Norwich, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News.